Crispy. Oh my god. Am I back right now? As you can see, that's what we got on deck right now. Supreme clientele. 15 minutes. Let's get it. Turn his fan off real quick. Like we're in the studio. Because we straight up are in the studio. Turn us down. All right, dude. Uh, yo, people, where have I been? Nah, dude. Uh, sometimes I just like forget to make videos when I got like stuff going on in my life or whatever. And um, I got a, a hit up on Twitter today, like, "Yo, are you alive?" <laughs> Whenever I get a "Are you alive?", I have to make a video. But um, wasn't like real prepared for this joint and um, a lot of stuff going on in personal life of uh, Crispy Land and all that stuff. So um, I won't get into that, but. Uh, that's neither here nor there. Real quick, this just arrived today in my mailbox. This this symbol right here is so ill. <laughs> it's like little uh, spray caps on these socks right here. Street Smarts, the brand. Guys, I really appreciate it. Um, I remember these guys hit me up and they were like asking me, uh, you know, like just a couple questions about graph and stuff like that. And, um, you know, I just kind of not consulted them, but basically was like, yeah, I think this is dope. I think that's dope. So they blessed me with a t-shirt and a pair of socks for, for just for the strength, just off strength. And I appreciate that. Thanks, guys. As you can see, as I've been doing that since since the days of Juicy, Crispy Coil, YouTube, Crispy Coil right there. So as you can see, the veteran, as I've been down with Griff, we got Wu in the background, always. All right, <clears throat> guys, I got two pairs here. What we're going to get into... Obviously, with all this Yeezy talk this week, I couldn't even breathe with all this Yeezy shit going on. Every single you, uh, Instagram post was like, oh my god, you see these Yeezys? They're either terrible or the hottest thing ever. And I get it, dude. Like, it's a shoe that's very polarizing. Like, you don't kind of like it. Like, um, it's not for me. Kanye didn't have me in my... Like, okay, when Kanye was thinking of this, it was probably him and Kim Kardashian at the Kriz. They were probably eating fruity pebbles, and Kanye was like, yo, Kim, I'm saying, like, Crispy and them really need these joints, and Kim was like, oh, F, F, Kanye, like, whatever, like, me and Jonathan need them, like, uh, and he was like, yeah, you're right, yo, you're right, I need to make these high fashion dips for all these, all these kids, and then, uh, I'm sure Chloe came in, and she was all like, you know? And, um, you know, then Bruce came in and he was like, I won the Olympics. Now I want to turn into a chick. Run that, you know. And then Ariza came in and he was just all like, Continental Drift, you know. So, uh, that I just really, wow, what just happened right there? Um, but, um, I'm sure that Crispy was not in Kanye's mind when he created them joints. Them John Baps are nowhere on my radio, on my radio, on my radar. Um, I'm college dropout Yeezy one Kanye kind of dude. Maybe even twisted uh, fantasy joint uh, Yeezy two crispy. That's like where I'm at. This this Yeezy is like ultra tight pleather pants, um, zippers on the side of the sweatshirt. Even though I kind of like that. Um, but uh, tight gear. You know what I'm saying? Like uh, and, and hey, if you can get away with rocking that stuff, it's all you. But I'm a husky dude. And I'm also 34 years old, so I kind of can't really get into that whole high fashion sense just because I don't really like it. Like, what am I going to do? Wear my polo denim and a fucking uh, polo bear sweater with a pair of Yeezys? Like, that just would look so unelementary. That's just a lackluster look for me. And the low joints just look like a Roshi. So, like, I dig it. I know why you guys dig it. I can respect it, but I just can't mess with it. So what I went out and did was I got a couple pairs of New Balance for the same price as the Yeezy. Actually cheaper. Um, so let's look. You could either have the Yeezy or have this. And it wasn't even an issue for me. Like, this is me all day, every day. You know what I'm saying? Yo, right when I saw this shoe, this noise is in the background. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> One more. New Balance, as you can see, made in England, made in the UK, Flimby. The boxes open up backwards, as all. 
All right, you got the rooster right here, clucking as usual. They say the whole thing right here to boy Billy Riley and them. Back in 1906, they were drinking. <laughs> they were drinking Manhattans, straight up rocks on the side, talking about how her feet hurt after all, a nice day of work in the mines. Um, and then all of a sudden, dude was like, "Yo, peep that chicken over there, son. Peep that chicken. That boy looks straight up fragile." And he was like, "Fragile? Nah, son, not fragile, man. That boy, that boy, that chicken over there looks like he's just straight up mean mugging." And they were like, "Yo, but look at his balance." And then they all stopped, and it was like, "Do li li." And he came up with an idea of a soul, of an insole that had the balance of a chicken's foot. And that's why I wear New Balance, because I like chickens. Wow. CT 1500 4, size 11 and a half. Laces that came with them. Of course, I always have to switch them out for my, my J. Crew laces that I've been waiting to use for like six years. All right. Right here, you have a 15 hundo. New Balance, Crooked Tongues. Shout out to Crooked Tongues, man. They're not going to be around anymore, and that sucks. They've had some of the best collaborations all time. The villain... Oh, my God. The Confederate Villainy Pack. Woo! Shout out to JD Beasy with that. It came with the little uh, joint right here, and, of course, it says, like, this was made uh, in a place just like today. No, I'm, I'm not going to go into that. But on the inside, it says Crooked Edition right there. Um, made in England. The shape is just is just real official. The leather is crazy. Fifteen hundred right here. I love this this green leather right here. Real high quality. And this is actually a new buck. A really really soft, really really soft new buck. I know you can't really see that. Um, you got the the drop shadow in the darker green, the lighter green for the end, and that white leather. I love how they have leather incorporated on this joint. But um, I got these for I believe a hundred bucks. Worn a couple times, but dude, I, I don't care at all. The quality, this have a ton of life left in them. I couldn't pass. Uh, I had the uh, black and orange pair that released with these, but I gave it to my man Manny. Manny, I might need them back. <laughs> nah, it's all good. But uh, yeah, Crooked Edition. You can't really front on these joints. 1500 is probably my favorite model right now, as you can see with these two pickups. Um, I actually have another one on the way. I love New Balance 1500s, especially from the UK. They have the shirt. They have the shape down pat. You just got, you can't really mess with it. All right, and then this right here was a, another 1500 FR, as you can see, made in England, flying the flag. Of course, you have Billy and them on the inside of this joint too. You have a dust bag, of course, flying the flag, manufacturing footwear since 1982 over in England. I love how um, the Flimby factory, they, they like, they pay homage to their employees, and I think that's so ill. Like, have you ever seen Nike take the time to like, okay, yo, yo, there's probably some vicious little Chinese lady over in the Nike factory in Shenzhen district. Yo, yo, she probably makes like 30 to 40 pairs of Air Force Ones a day by herself. Yo, they probably have her, her own little wing where she's just mangling shit all day long. Like, no glue stains on her shit. Like... You know she gets all the overtime, you know what I mean? Like, yo, she probably she probably trains all the new people to come in. Like, why don't Nike make a shoe for her? They could call it, like, the Air Soon Lee. You know what I'm saying? Like, you never see Nike pay no respects to, to all their employees. Like, New Balance puts out whole lines. Yo, like the Billy Edgar joints. I got them over here somewhere. Yeah, right here. 576. They picked out one of their long-term employees and made a shoe for him. Like, man. And I know a lot of you guys look at New Balance like it's the old man shoe. Whatever, I am an old man. I ain't going to front. But um, if you want to just try something new that's very high quality, super comfortable, and looks great with a pair of jeans or some some khakis or some uh, capri pants or whatever. And there's what I was talking about with the little uh, the first insole they made back in 1906. But um, you can get a Made in American pair if you're not down with the Made in England pair. You know what I mean? I'm a union dude, so of course I like to pay respects to America, but... Man, UK is just on fire with these 15 hundos. 1500, made in England. Flying the flag on the inside, same thing. You have the, the Union Jack on the back heel right here. Nice touch. Everything is all red, the whole thing. Suede toe box, not a mesh. This suede is 
absolutely incredible. What else? Can, I mean, what more do you expect from from these guys? You know what I mean? Tonal laces. Um, I mean, I could throw on it with the white pair, but I think the red pair does it enough justice. I really dig these joints. Um, these are on New Balance's website for like 250 or something crazy. If you want them, you can get them over at uh, Sneakers and Stuff and End for like one 170 something like that. But um, use the code Sneakers right now. I had Sneakers and Stuff, just Sneakers, and you can get these for way cheaper. They came out with a uh, 577 in gray, and I believe a 300 or a 330 in navy. Um, but uh, this joint right here was the one that I liked. As you can see, it's just all... This right here is just a red leather. This is like some kind of weird leather new buck. It's crazy. I can't explain it. But the inside is like a really soft mesh. What more can you say about these two 1500s right here? Um, I had to just get a video out for you guys. I didn't want to leave you guys too long without a vid. I've been kind of away for a while. I'll be back. You know what I mean? I'm never going to be gone forever and, and stuff like that. Um... Let's see what else we got in here that I can kind of just uh, show you guys. Alright, this is probably one of the most slept on replacement box. <laughs> New Balance 1400 Made in America. J. Crew, as you can see, made in USA, fourteen hundred. This shoe right here is ultra comfortable. Two piece right there on the midsole. Black leather and right here for the logo. Of course, on the inside you have just the average. This right here, uh, I got this for ultra cheap. My man hooked me up from the outlet, uh, and I know like Nikes are really popular. And look, I mess with Nikes. Like I'm, I can't say I don't. But, like, say you wanted to try a pair of New Balance, like, this is a 1400. They all look kind of like the same, but, uh, it's neither here nor there. So, people, what's been going on, man? I've been watching a lot of these videos, stuff like that. I love the content you dudes put out. I don't know how you make videos every day, guys. Like, that's crazy. Um, I wish I had time to do that. It would be awesome. Like, if I could just not work all these hours and do this kind of stuff. Man, look at that. Two fifteen hundred. If you could pick one, which one would it be? Obviously, most people are gonna pick these, right? Yeah, I would probably. But you can't, you can't front on this red joint. And of course, it came with the, uh, the made in the UK. A little bit of reading material, you know. So it's not bad. It came with the dust bag. I thought that was cool. Got two minutes left here, people. Um, real talk. Um, I don't know what's going to happen in the near future, stuff like that. So, uh, I think I'll always keep the channel going. Um, but, uh, I appreciate everybody, man. All you guys that leave comments and stuff like that. Like, yo, for real, all jokes aside, like, um, life outside of YouTube isn't always great, but I try to, to come in here with a, with a good attitude and stuff like that and, um, leave videos for you guys. And, um, there's one thing about me, like I might never get all these cool, uh, free things that other people get and trips out to certain places because I do curse and I am me and that's and that's fine like I'm not doing it for all that I'm doing it to touch base with you guys and to show you guys my passion for these kicks and um if it's New Balance it's New Balance if it's Nike it's Nike and you guys get it um I appreciate that you guys you know mess with me on that level and um honestly like uh it really helps to to know that I have friends out there that I met through doing this. Today is my eighth year being sober today. And um, eight years ago today was not a good time for me. And uh, it just brings back a lot of memories and everything I got going on with my family right now. And um, life is real at this moment. And um, I, I owe a lot of uh, my sobriety and where I'm at to, uh, to sneakers for real. And um, uh, at the time I got sober, I didn't have a hobby. And this turned into a part of my life it's not a huge part of my life but it's in my life and so are you guys whether you like it or not and um all the comments i get just the back and forth with you guys helps me so much so please if you can um leave a comment down there below you know what i mean what would you like to see more from me um what do you you know like or dislike about the channel like what's up you know what i mean holler i could really use uh the feedback and that kind of stuff and um hit the like button if you can you know what i'm saying but um this is me this is Crispy. You're listening to Supreme Clientele right now. It's Ghostface if you want to download it. Um, Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Dosis califragilisticexpialidocious. Ali Super. K. 
catch me in the Cancun eating grouper or whatever, all that. Crispy, fish grease, two fingers, the lab. Jake will be in the next video. We're back. Hit me up. Peace.